and hey guys uh, this is like another video on like how to make the Roland Juno 106 velocity sensitive this is not possible in hardware it's you can only do it by using uh, this program here and like and if you want to know how to set this up uh, just check my other video on Juno 106 but uh, listen to this As you can see here, there is like a velocity sensitivity, and uh, this is done by programming reason, and uh, also like this VSTR Juno 106 editor. And the thing how to make is is by using a Thor patch, uh, which you. First, you start uh, create a Thor pad, the Thor, and initialize it. Then go to last key and velocity. Then put it on hun on max, under. Then destination CV output one. Then flip back around. Put the CV one into the CV in of the external MIDI instrument. Uh, and right now, I'm controlling the. Uh, voltage control amplifier I think it's called and we can watch it if I play this here you can watch this fade out. and you see it adapts after like the velocity and like if you want to like a velocity sensitive filter you can just change this one to 87 See, and there you have a like a velocity sensitive uh, Juno 106. It's pretty cool, and yeah, and uh, yeah, I was also using the outer theory to make, like make the chords. But yeah, that's how you make how you make the Juno 106 from Roland velocity sensitive. And yeah.